What is up, everyone? Welcome to the channel, Fleetwood Mac. I've just been getting into Fleetwood Mac, and, and I want to keep it going. So today we are checking out thanks to um, a donation from Michael. Michael, thank you, brother. Michael says, um, Fleetwood Mac's I'm So Afraid isn't their most famous song, but you're going to love Lindsay's finger style live guitar solos. Ali's Hauntingly Beautiful comes to mind. My wife loves to, to bring up, you know, describing things as hauntingly beautiful and has become one of my favorite descriptions too. So, Michael, thank you for watching long enough to understand like us bringing that up. This is more of a Pink Floydish performance. I am so intrigued by that, Michael, that let's, let's do this. Let's do this right now. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. Um, a lot of people on the channel are recognizing I, I'm loving the, these, this music and these suggestions with just fantastic guitar, especially finger style plucking. I didn't know that that was really a thing. Like the first time we checked out Dire Straits, I was like, people are this good with just their fingers? You probably see the guitar, the guitars back there. Um, when I first started playing guitar, I, I started learning metal and neoclassical metal. For some reason, that's what I got into at that age. Then going into high school and then for years beyond that, I was an acoustic guitar player for to sing as well. I started off as a guitarist. I joined choir just out of nowhere and senior year I performed and won a global sales, I mean a, a state um, voice competition thing here in Utah. So I became more of a singer and acoustic guitar player, right? But that's where I stopped. I'm as good on the guitar as I was when I was 20 years old. So now with more time, I've been uh, learning more about some of these guitarists that are just getting me. I don't know what I, I don't know what I was about to say. I was about to say getting me going, but that sounds, you know, that sounds weird. But you know what I mean. So I appreciate the suggestion and I've loved learning more about Fleetwood Mac. So let's do this. If you clicked on this video, thank you. You're probably here because you're a Fleetwood Mac fan. Welcome. Whatever worries, concerns you have in your life right now, let's let them go. And just together virtually here and with all of your friends that are down in the comment section, send each other some love. And let's just enjoy good music together, yeah? And escape to fill our cups to tackle what we gotta tackle. So let's do this, guys. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Dude, that drummer is so cool. Dude, that finger pumping is unbelievable. Just that reverb and delay, it sounds so good.
Quick pause, if you're new to these sorts of videos, we're, we're supposed to take pauses. Okay, I had to look up what his guitar is, because what is this? So this was like a prototype he built. Yeah, fascinated by that thing. His sound is so good, dude. It's so good. Yet the set, the song is heartbreaking. We'll talk lyrics more later, man, but this is great. The way she compliments his voice is so great. Lindsay Buckingham, dude. Here we go. Ooh. I, I, this is a beautiful solo, and I don't want to screw it up. The way, just the way he's plucking that, I had to just watch that again. I won't interrupt the solo again, sorry, that was just, it, it was instinctual, I need to see what he did there. See, he's, like, that's so weird. Floyd vibes to describe the solo, that was very well said. with this through this solo It's 
It, the guitar is crying. He's he's weeping right now. That was a fantastic one of my favorite solos I've heard. Oh yeah. Okay, let's let's read the chorus here. Days when the rain and the sun are gone, black as night, agonies torn at my heart too long, so afraid, slip and I fall and I die. How I feel, days when the rain and the suns are gone, black as night, agony's torn at my heart too long, so afraid, slip and I fall and I die. He was saying that with his guitar for that solo. You felt the torment, the crying, the desperation with the... That was so great, dude. Lindsey Buckingham is a fantastic guitarist and the sound of that guitar, wow. When asked about it, I'm no Jimi Hendrix. I don't have the level of proficiency to just let myself go off into something completely different every night, nor do I think I would want to. I am someone who values musical themes, someone who feels there should be consistency from night to night with something. I'm not one of those people that can just slam out a completely different solo every night because I don't have the skill to do that. But I'm with that. He what needed to be said needed to be said on the guitar and that's fantastic song was written by lindsey buckingham phenomenal dude i've been really enjoying learning more about fleetwood mac really really enjoying it michael thanks for that lindsey buckingham bro yeah <laughs> that was satisfying as all get out how do you feel let me know comment down below Woo. underrated guitarist suspenseful solo yeah, that, that, that's a fantastic solo, dude. Things with the title of the video will be one of my new favorite solos. Well, guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope you had a good time, as much of a good time as I did. Um, if you want to support our channel, um, hit like, subscribe. Check out the description down below to find ways. To all of you who have donated and tipped and helped the channel, thank you so much. Wow, that, that was satisfying. Yes, hauntingly beautiful. That's how you speak with a guitar, bro. Much love, everybody.